Well, boys and gals, um, the NFC side of the wild card has just ended. Game, last game of the doubleheader today, just ended. Uh, first off, the Minnesota Vikings. They win in overtime against the New Orleans Saints. They, and as the sixth seed, they'll be moving on to face the San Francisco 49ers, man. And. In the game that just finished up, Seattle, the Seahawks, overcome the Philadelphia Eagles um, to win that game. They're going to face the Green Bay Packers, you know. Um, so, how do we get here? How do we get to this point? Um, well, for, you know, about a couple, it was a neck-and-neck -neck game for the Vikings and the Saints for a while. Um. You know, the Saints had some moments, you know, Taysom Hill being a good example of a guy that can just do whatever he wants. But, you know, at the very end of the game, there was just a lot that happened, man. I mean, there was just some weird clock management. Um, Drew Brees, you know, he really didn't do too much. He did enough, but he didn't do too much. And, um... Vikings were able to capitalize, you know, Dalvin Cook was able to run the ball to the end zone, um, and Adam Thielen, or was it Rudolph, Ru I believe Rudolph caught that ball, right, I'm, I'm terrible, uh, Rudolph caught the, um, the, 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 uh, the game winner, um, stuff like that, in the back of the end zone, it was either him or Thielen, I can't remember exactly, because I'm old, but the Vikings, move on and the Saints defense could not get a stop in overtime and the Vikings are going to move on to face the 49ers next what Sunday or Saturday I don't know which day it is um, matter of fact let's check that right now let's check let's check the uh, playoff schedule man for next for next week um, we already went over you know, the um, the NFC side, the AFC side of things, my bad. Um, so, next Saturday at, what, 4, 4 o'clock, 4.30 um, Eastern, 3.30 in the Central Time Zone, like I am, it will be the Minnesota Vikings taking on the San Francisco 49ers on Sunday at 5.40 or 6.40, depending on where you are. Um, living at it'll be Seattle taking on Green Bay in Lambeau. It'll probably be cold. It'll probably be snowing. But the game that I just watched had a little bit more to it. Um, it was a kind of a slow game for Seattle and Philadelphia. Um, you know, Russell Wilson was doing doing his thing. You know, um, Seattle's defense was just stifling. But the main thing that happened was Carson Wentz getting a concussion, and he was forced to lead the rest of the game. And the Eagles had to rely on Josh McCown to get something going, but ultimately the Eagles couldn't get anything going. They only scored field goals again. Um, they only scored field goals in this game. Um, just three field goals, 17 to 9 was the final, you know. Um, I know Marshawn got in the end zone, powered his way to the end zone um, for a touchdown early on. And, you know, um, that was about a. a all the significance that he did, but uh, Russell Wilson was just out here balling once again, man. Um, a couple of good throws, especially the end of the game, the one to DJ Met DK Metcalf, not DJ Metcalf, DK Metcalf. The end of the game was an absolute beauty of a throw. Um, so yeah, um, Seahawks really didn't really had the fight to win this game. And they did it. They did it. They're going to the. They're going to the divisional round, and so you know it's gonna be a fun time. You know, in the divisional round, um, to see what the Seahawks can do against Green Bay because Green Bay really hasn't looked like the team to beat. To be, or rather, the team that they were supposed to be. You know, a thirteen and three team that 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 um that the Packers are, and they just don't look like a thirteen and three team. Um, San Francisco also has some problems. Um, Kirk Cousins, you know, he got he got a playoff win. He got it. He got a big time win when he needed it. There's always been that that 
stigma against Kirk Cousins. But can he do it again? Can he do it again next week? We'll find out. We can't, can Russell Wilson and the Seahawks have enough life to beat Green Bay? We'll find out next week. We'll find all this stuff out next week. So with that being said, everybody, um, I'm going to get ready. Um, do my college basketball stuff here on this channel. You guys are the real MVPs. Y'all take care, and we'll see you guys in a few minutes. Thank you.